Time now to take you to New York City, where Doc Emmerich and John Davidson are set to call the action between the Rangers and the Detroit Red Wings. So let's send you out to Madison Square Garden. Hovering over the largest city is the hockey team's hope for the playoffs. Wayne Gretzky single-handedly has kept that possibility alive, and 18,200 Ranger watchers are here today as the Rangers take on none other than the Stanley Cup champions from Detroit. Good afternoon, everyone. Along with John Davidson, I'm Mike Emery. Thrilling atmosphere here at Madison Square Garden. Desperation for the Rangers, but they've won three desperate home games in a row. But they still trail Ottawa for that last playoff spot in the East, Mike, by five points. Gretzky's been their best player. President, general manager acquired Wayne Gretzky for nothing. And he's been able to provide this team a lot of offense. Since John Muckler took over as coach, 17 points in 11 games, he's been Mr. Everything for this hockey club offensively. The genius of Wayne Gretzky is that he can conceive of a plan and in just a couple of seconds execute it. He did it last week in Boston. I'll fake it. Yeah, because I'll fake it there, Sonny. Straight down the middle. You heard Wayne say straight down the middle, he'll fake it. You'll see a little fake there to Sundstrom in front. Instead, he went to Leach right down the middle. Gretzky's calling his own power play plays. Detroit, I think, will play Lidstrom and Murphy, the defense pairing against Wayne, and a, probably a couple of different forward lines. They've got to try to stop Gretzky to win. Detroit is seven points from first and seven points away from fourth. Is that a comfort zone? Well, I think with Detroit, you know, you look at their lineup, Mike, maybe it is, but they have five forwards out and Osgood, the goalie, out. They want to find some offense and shut Gretzky down. I think with Fedorov and center ice, and if Scotty Bowman keeps his line together with Kozlov and Brown, and Scotty jumps around with his lines, but this should be the line to provide offense. They have been recently in the last five games. They need offense. Larionov is out with a groin injury. Fedorov could be the answer. 